Hello everyone. This is you, me, I gaming logging in, and this is the mobile fo phone game Stellaris Galaxy Command. And since this is our first video, we will be discussing about one of the most basic tip in the game that is mothballing ships. So why do we mothball ships? We all know that there's a certain maintenance cost attached to having ships activated in our uh, docks and it is like for example cruisers we have 0.55 living metal per day now for example if we have 100 cruisers with us then the living metal requirement per day can shoot up to 55 living metal per day and as we know that the production of living metal is really really low it is like 86 per day even after having almost maxed metal shapers so how to save them how to save the cornerstones and living metal the answer is we can mothball ships so we there's, there are two ways to mothball ships first is going to the three liner then fleets manage dock ship storage and there you can mothball as many ships as you want i'll just be mothballing one destroyer right now and this these are all the ships i have mothballed so i'm saving like tons of resources every day due to the mothballing of my ships moreover the other benefit is that if some big player attacks me with like uh, four to five million power my mothballed ships will be safe and they won't have a scratch on them the other way we can mothball ships is to go to functions dock ship storage and there you go as you can see i have around 500 destroyers and a hundred over 100 cruisers with me so this is saving me a lot of alloy living metal and cornerstone because if we calculate it uh, by the maintenance fees of each each uh, ship then it will just be huge amount and there's another uh, thing that you should keep in mind with mothballing ships is that you should have it a sizable fleet in your hand at any time for example i got like 532,000 fleets right now with me anytime so that i can attack a level 11 pirate anytime and get the goodies because attacking pirates is really really important as we have discussed so it is not at all advisable to mothball all your ships leaving none on your hand you need to understand how many ships you require at any given point of time to attack pirates and also whenever you are going to war you need to unmothball the ships a uh, size around two to three hours before the war starts because you cannot uh, push for you know you cannot speed up the unmothballing well hope you enjoyed the video we will be posting regular tips on our channel and we also have our website that is Stellaris Galaxy Command dot in do visit it and do like share and subscribe to our videos thank you and have a nice day.